सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई विल टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट न्यू एंड अमेजिंग रिगिड बॉडी डायनेमिक एनिमेशन विदाउट यूजिंग एनी थर्ड पार्टी एड ऑन सी गाइस द एक्ट्स आर रियली कूल एंड सिंपल एनिमेशन राइट सी ओके सो गाइस नाउ आई टीच यू हाउ आई क्रिएट दिस टाइप ऑफ डायनेमिक इफेक्ट सो गाइस स्टॉप एंड गाइस आई शो यू माय सिंपल रेंडर रेंडर एंड रेंडर इमेज चेक या सी गाइस दैट सम ब्यूटीफुल एनिमेशन एंड डायनेमिक इफेक्ट सो गाइस क्लोज सो गाइस नाउ आई टीच यू हाउ आई क्रिएट दिस टाइप ऑफ इफेक्ट सो स्टॉप एंड आई क्रिएट न्यू प्रोजेक्ट एंड न्यू चेक सो गाइस सेलेक्ट ऑल एंड प्रेस डिलीट की सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल गाइस आई एम गोइंग टू टेक अ सिंपल प्लेन एंड इंक्रीज प्लेन साइज सो गाइस स्केल साइज लाइक अ स्केल 20 एंड गाइस गो टू ऑन ऐड and i use this time monkey object like this yeah so guys little bit up and guys i apply subdivision surface for more smoothness so go to on here and i apply subdivision surface and subdivision level 2 and render to and apply yeah and right click shade smoother okay so guys next one this time i apply some lego games object so go to on file up and Guys, you can download this object link in description. So go to on here and select. So collection check and append. See guys, that's my 3D object, right? So closer. See guys, that's my 3D object, right? Okay, so now guys, a little bit increase this size, little bit increase. So right click on this null object and select hierarchy and press S letter. and scale size increase like this yeah and guys select this one little bit back okay so guys next one i apply dynamic animation so guys frame i like 800 frames 800 and guys firstly i create this time rotation animation this one monkey rotation so guys that's my rotation and rotation check so go to on last and rotation value i like 1440 1440 and animation check and guys select your key and press t and use liner check so guys play yeah that's my simple effect right okay so guys now next one select your monkey and go to on here and i apply rigid body so rigid body check and guys this time that's my type i like passive and guys so you setting an animation check so guys shape that's my mesh i like mesh and next one go to on surface and friction i like 0.1 and bounce 0.1 yeah that's it guys that's my simple rigid body effect and guys next one select your this one break so guys select first kit first break and rigid body check so guys active type active and go to on here shape guys that's my so it's my cube effect so shape i like cube so friction 0.5 actually 0.1 and bounce 0.1 enter yeah right okay so guys select your first key and select all holding shift key and select all and go to on object so go to on rigid body and i like copy from active check yes that's it guys right and play okay so guys select your this one that's my plane and i apply same rigid body and it's my passive so friction okay all is good so guys play yeah that's my simple effect right and guys play okay so guys now i change gravity so guys go to on here and gravity i like zero and play Okay, so guys, it's not animate. So guys, this time I apply force field. This one force, and guys play. Actually, press one and go to a mid on this one monkey object, and yeah, it's mid. So guys, click on here. So strength I like zero, and strength check. So go to like a one fifty frame, and strength minus one hundred, and the check. Yes. So guys, again play. Okay, see guys, that's my dynamic effect. See, right? It's looking really simple, right? That's my simple effect. Okay, so guys, 
it's automatically stop on 250 frames so go to on here and guys rigid body is what so catch it and guys frame i like 800 and check okay so guys next one this time i apply this one turbulence i like trouble and guys turbulence i like 50 and enter so guys again play okay see guys that's my turbulence effect yes great okay so guys all is good and now guys select your kit and guys i change center so guys right click on this kit select hierarchy and go to an object and this one origin to geometry check and guys play okay see guys that's my first work and next one guys i apply more objects so guys stop and guys i apply more so guys select your kit select hierarchy so press ctrl c and v and go to on this one collection so go to on top so guys press 7 that's my top view so i like top so guys little bit up like this yes and guys i apply more objects so press ctrl c and v so go to on here so press 1 and guys rotate your object randomly like this yeah and guys rotation 90 enter so guys again duplicate so press ctrl c and v go to on here and again rotation so guys rotation like this okay so guys select this one select hierarchy and object like this like a 270 enter yes see guys that's my different different position animation and guys select this one and collection check okay so guys select hierarchy go to on here yes and guys now again play yeah see guys that's my really cool dynamic effect right it's looking really beautiful guys you can apply more object this depend on your work so i apply more so guys select this one and select hierarchy so guys duplicate so go to on here and rotate so rotation like this yeah so guys little bit increase scale size little bit yeah okay so guys one more last time duplicate and rotate okay so rotate like this yes so guys you can increase randomly size so guys select this one and hierarchy link little bit increase size this one yes and again play yeah right okay so guys my dynamic effect is really good and now guys this time i apply gravity animation so guys stop and guys go to on here and i create gravity effect so guys go to like a 200 frames 200 and guys gravity are like zero so now guys i go to like a 350 and guys i like minus guys my gravity 9.8 enter and check yes okay so now guys 450 randomly guys i like zero and check so guys again play so closer yeah it's looking really good and guys after 250 to 200 frames gravity it will change yeah see guys that's my gravity effect right see and guys go to an up yeah beautiful guys right that's my gravity effect okay so guys now stop and guys i create more effect so like a 500 and 500 gravity and zero check so go to like a 550 550 frames and gravity minus 9.8 and the check and guys lastly go to on like a 100 frames more like a 650 and 
gravity i will change so gravity i like zero yes and guys play okay so guys now go to one catch a here and bake all dynamic this one bake all dynamic check okay so guys my baking is finished and now guys play guys my animation it's really good and best animation for me so now guys next one i apply camera and light yeah right see guys that's my zero gravity effect and after that go to on here yeah great okay so now guys next one stop so i take camera and camera check so guys go to on back and camera change so guys go to on zero frame so guys select your camera so position change 90 0 and 0 so guys closer 0 and guys in y axis change yes okay like a minus 8 enter and guys now select this one this one kit so right click select hierarchy so guys little bit down and guys go to on here catch a big delete big check yes see guys that's my camera angle guys now i create background so guys select this one and go to on edit mode select edge so press e and g enter so go to on up guys i create backdrop and guys use this time bevel effect so bevel amount 0.2 and segments are like 30 and right click shade smoother so guys i like this time light pink material light pink like this and roughness 0.3 yes so guys select this one and i create like a this one material yes and guys roughness roughness is good so now guys i change render setting cycle render device gpu check and render and samp 512 and guys all is good so guys click on here and i apply sdri image environment texture check so sdri i like this one and next one guys i like lighting lighting check so guys up and light position and actually power like a 250 and size are like 3 yes and duplicate this light so guys light so press control c and v and go to on here guys that's my front light so rotate rotate like this like a 90 enter okay so guys now press 0 and go to on here and guys bake all dynamic check Okay so guys my baking is finished and now guys play yeah it's looking really beautiful right okay so guys my animation is finished that's my final work yeah and guys also select this one plane and delete all big check so guys select your plane and i apply one more time rigid body so passive check and guys go to on catch it and bake all dynamic check okay so guys my baking is finished and now go to back and play yeah see guys that's my final work right that's my final animation and also guys you can create camera position animation is dependent on your work okay so guys now i show you my render setting so guys stop go to on here frame rate this one 30 fps and go to on output guys i create simple render sequences is and take any file name like a one and guys go to on here render and render image check guys i show you only one frame render okay so guys now i create like a metallic effect on this one monkey object so guys close and guys select your material So guys go to on here metallic metallic I like one enter 
and again go to on render and render image check okay so guys my render is finished and my material is really beautiful and guys close so guys go to on back so render and render animation check okay so guys my work is finished so guys if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel thank you